So first of all, congratulations on the nomination. How does it feel to be shortlisted for a Mercury Prize? You yeah. can't, like, I think you can't really try and play it down or play it cool. It's um, just a huge honour as an artist to have something you've worked really, really hard on and put your heart into, to have it recognised in this way is just really special. Because this is our fourth album and the timing of, of it is is, is kind of crazy because we took a five-year break from the third album to this one. Stick around when it all turns real and my bets come rolling. The album came out in February, like just before the world turned on its head and um, we were really gutted because we just thought this album could get forgotten about and that was really heartbreaking to us because we put quite a lot into it and the tours got cancelled and I know we're in the same boat as a lot of a lot of bands actually and then this happened and it's just like a really a really class thing to happen at this point in time and you're flying the flag for the northeast this year so no pressure there I think we might even be the only band from like the north of England that's been shortlisted actually quite a lot of pressure now <laughs> a lot of pressure now <laughs> don't look now here come the baddies on a wave of hate. So let's talk about the album, Spook the Herd. How would you describe it? The album was influenced by just how I was feeling at that point in time, just as a person to be living in these quite surreal times, should we say, um, with like a lot of division and polarised politics and things like that. And this looming threat of um, climate change on the horizon. Tonight. I think at the heart of it, the album is about um, hope and trying to find a way through together and um, overcoming fear. Would you say it has a northeast sensibility about it in any way? Yeah, um, I think all of our records, they sound the way they do because of where we're from. This. Um we see this every day. The record was written here in North Shields. So I think subconsciously that, that does permeate into the sound of the album, I guess. What would winning the Mercury Prize mean to you both? I don't think we've really let our minds drift into that way of thinking. We're just so chuffed to be shortlisted. So. Um, but to win would be just mind-blowing. It's not something we're expecting, though. If we would, it would be the best thing that's ever happened to us, ever. Did you get them shouting about their crabs? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>